So we use the analogy of a bubble to describe our fibre. When you blow a bubble, you see lots of different colours reflected on its surface. This comes from the curvature and the thickness of the bubble film. We use these principles to trap the specific wavelengths within our fibre and guide it over long lengths. My research is on designing and fabricating optical holical fibres. So standard optical fibres are usually made by solid material, and the light is guided by total internal reflection. On the other hand, so light in a free space will diffract and spread out very quickly. By introducing a bubble-like microstructure, we can trap light in the fiber, and the light can be guided through the fiber for over 100 meters. I am also fabricating these fibers with short wavelengths, so that we can put them with iridium vapor to make a fiber based on my clock. I make these fibers and then fill them with acetylene gas to produce a gas field laser for long wavelengths. I also fill these fibers with gas, but I then use electricity to make them glow and then I'm turning this into a laser. I'm heat treating and stretching the holocaust fibers that we make here to make them thinner and that they will be able to guide visible wavelengths. I make and use these holocaust fibers to build a laser with a long length that produces shot pulses with a low repetition rate. 